Welcome to Rasya Viruna. Today I am quite excited to show you something which I have never done before in my channel. That's nothing but the unboxing of the latest addition to our kitchen. And that's right here. It's the Preeti Zodiac Mixer and Grinder. So the box itself looks quite exciting and I cannot wait to open and see what's inside. And let me tell you a few other exciting things what comes along with it. It is the guarantee of the product for 2 years, the motor warranty for 5 years and the lifelong free service. And also let me tell you this video is not sponsored. This was just made out of the mere excitement of me seeing this box right outside my door. And uh, let's not waste any time and go see what's inside. So first and foremost, let's see the base unit. If you look at the shape, this is quite a fantasy because uh, this is the first time I'm seeing this shaped mixer and it uh, claims to be a tripod shaped base unit. So um, this is quite uh, interesting for me. Now let's switch on the power. Yes, the next wow thing about this base unit is the LED light which turns blue when the power is on. And uh, as in general, we have all the speeds 0, 1, 2, 3 and also a pulse. Now let's move on to the specifications, what's written over here. So the first one says Vega W5 motor, which was already there in the box. The second one is the faster motor cooling, which was also said in the box. The third one is uh, quite new to me because it says overload safety indicator. Now in general, a mixy does does not operate when there is an overload and uh, we do not get an indication about why the mixer got switched off is it because the current was not there or was it overload so this helps us to indicate that the mixer was switched off because of the overload and also how it indicates is the blue light which was turned on when the power is on turns to red so what we need to do when it is switched off due to overload what we need to do is we have a reset button under the base you just need to press this which would reset the mixer the last one is the tripod design which was quite a fantasy to me when i just opened the box so that's it about the base unit now let's move on to the different jars and details okay so this is the first jar which i'm going to show you and uh, this is a 0.5 liter chutney jar which has a fixed blade as you can see it has a fixed blade and uh, you can also grind the turmeric in this in just two minutes so that's the most speciality that they have uh, already described in the box so this is about it let's move on to the next jar so this is the next jar which is uh, one liter and it has removable blades as you can see you can remove it after use so that it gets more clean and which is quite beneficial so this is about it so this is the next jar the third jar which is a 1.5 liter wet grinding jar and it also has a removable blade just like we as we saw in one liter jar so that's it so the next is the fourth jar which is quite interesting to see again just like the base unit and this is 3-in-1 Insta Fresh Fruit Jar. So I'll just open and show you one by one. Number one. Number two. Number three. So how it looks inside is this. So this blade is removable, which is seen inside. And this blade is used when you need to extract the fruit juice. Now, once you remove it, we have an extra blade which is given along with the box. You can place this and use it as a blender. So that's why it's called 3-in-1. It has, it's like a multi-purpose jar. Now the next is this uh, cap, the spout cap. So if you remove the cap, you can actually place the spout into it and extract the juice through this. So I'm going to show you how you place this on top of the base unit. Let, let's just see that. So this is how you place the jar on top of the base unit. The next goes the filter. So just need to see the slot correct and just place it. The next is the lid, the juicer lid. You have placed it. The next is the pusher. 
so you close it so next comes the spout you just need to place this here. so this is how you actually connect the three in one fresh fruit jar to the base unit so as i told you uh, this blade is removable so this is the blade used to extract the juice now you can use this extra blade which is used which turns this out to a blender so i'm going to show you see there's a lock over here just twist it and just remove it and you can take this out and just place this blade on top of it and it's there you go yeah and then you just need to place it over this and it acts as a blender so this is the fifth and final jar in the Preeti Zodiac and this is called food processor bowl which is ideally used for multi-purpose like atta kneading, vegetable chopping, slicing and grating and also for citrus press. Now let's go into the detail of the food processor bowl. So how you need to open this is there's a small lock, lock over here, just need to twist it slowly and it's opened so there's a push over here with the measurement which says water for one cup floor so you can add one cup floor with the same measuring cup also one cup water with the same measuring cup which is ideally a pusher for the food processing bar so uh, this is the plastic blade used for atta kneading so you can actually remove it so that you can insert different kind of blades for different purpose. So this is the plastic blade for atta kneading. Uh, so let's remove this and insert the blade used for the chopping of vegetables. So you just need to insert this and place it back into the food processor bowl. So you can uh, chop your vegetables. Let's insert it into the right slot. So there you go. So uh, this was all about the unboxing and giving you the details, the minute details of the Preeti Zodiac Mixer and Grinder. Hope you all enjoyed the video and also I believe that you understood the different purpose of the different jars given in the box. Also what makes it different from the other mixer jars, mixer grinder jars available in the market today. So in the description box right below, I'm going to give you the link to buy the same. And if you are interested, if you liked it, please give it a try. And uh, see you soon in another video. Until then, bye-bye.